Good fucking morning. Right. See that figure by my head? You know, that Pink Floyd triangle. I know, it's an upside down pyramid. There is a very good reason for it being upside down, because I didn't like it the way it was, because the way it was, the evil soulless cunts were on top. <laughs> well, I turn the pyramid upside down, and I stick the wankers underneath the light. And trust me, they can't get up up the light, because they got blocked. I'm still at the bottom in the middle. I'm, I'm right at the tip of that thing above my head. There. I'm right there at the tip of that, that thing there. That's where I live. Well, I've been living there for all my life. I've always lived at the bottom in the middle. But now I'm still at the bottom in the middle. But I've turned a triangle up so down. And I know this will sound mental, but trust me, all of you lot are on top. I'm still at the bottom. Yeah, but I'm just dealing with the shit that below the light. You lot can fucking go and have a real life above the light. I'm still dealing with the crap below the light. I know. Uh, not very nice, actually. Shit job dealing with shit. Especially when there was evil, it was the shit I'm dealing with. And trust me, you you think you know evil. Ah, uh, when you come across these evil bastards, you don't know nothing. You absolutely know nothing about evil. With these guns. Even I am blown away how evil these guns are. Fuck. I know. I really ain't happy about it. Actually, I know. I put out a good video this morning of niceness and love and light, but yeah, I still got to tell you about the evil shit though. Because it's still here, and I'm still having difficulty getting rid of it. It ain't fucking nice. You don't realise how evil these bastards are. I know. They don't give a fuck if they torture and slaughter their children and eat them and drink the blood of them. That is nothing compared to what they do. They do ten times worse than that. Um, Jesus Christ. All right, I... Um, well, happy buddy. I know, I got a drink and I know things t-shirt on today. I do drink. Well, I do know things, but... Um, I really wish I didn't know things. If the truth I know. Especially the shit I know. Because it ended up in, I've ended up with a mental disorder way past your normal disorder. Oh, you, you think, you think you've got PTSD? <laughs> you should deal with the fucking soldiers who are coming up from underground, what I have to deal with. And I'm trying to fix them. When they're coming up, I know they're all going in bed beds on the moon, along with the 50 million children I've put on the moon because of so many children I've saved. But I will be honest with you, not all of them are human. So, but they're still children. Well, you're all my children, if, if you're tripping out. I know, I didn't want this fucking job. But I'm, I am taking it seriously. 
So you're all my fucking children. All right. Tough shit. I know. I shouldn't fucking go this way, but that pyramid is upside down for a reason. And if you look, well, all the shit above the light used to be, when it was the other way around, all the shit above the light was in charge. Now, all the shit is under the light is not in charge because they've been sacked because their evil soul is used to scumbag cunts. I know, a bit like all the governments and all the leaders in the world and all these corrupt, evil bastards who've been running all the corporations. Mm. Uh, shit. Yeah, well, they've been caught. Well, I, I'll have to admit, it takes a criminal and it catch a criminal. And, yeah. Oh, I used to be a good con artist back in the day. I used to be able to con myself. <laughs> can't con myself now. Mm, uh, I can't even con anybody, to be honest. And I, I quite like that fact that I can't con anybody anymore. And now it will sound a bit mental. But we've all been fucked over. Every single fucking one of us. We've all been cons. I hate it. Well, you think I like being cons? Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't. I'm pretty sure you won't like finding out that you've all been conned. But you have. I, I didn't want this shit to happen this way. But the only way I can do all this is to I mean, it's totally destroy it and start again. I know. You're not ready for change, are you? Tough shit. You're going to get it. <laughs> I can't stop it. It's been happening for a long time. I didn't realise I actually started this back in the 80s. Oh, crap. I know. Well, I probably started it in the 70s, but I didn't know what I was doing in the 70s. But I definitely kicked it off in the 80s. I remember kicking it off back in 1984 when I met King Charlie Ted or Prince Ted. Whatever you want to call it, yeah, he's not fucking human anyway. The best times, he's been dead since 2019, but that's beside the point. But you, you lot ain't gonna believe none of that crap because nobody's gonna believe any of this crap, even when you get it shoved in your face 20 million times, you will not believe it. I know. Shit. It doesn't matter how many times you get fired in your face, you ain't going to see it, are you? No. The only way I'm going to wake you wankers up is actually kill you. I'm going to have to throw you off a cliff and stop you dying before you hit the floor. I don't really like doing that. I don't like killing people and saving them in the same breath. It's not my cup of tea. Personally, I would rather not kill anybody. I'm not a violent person, believe it or not. 
All right, I can be running in a few right on my coach. I'd rather you didn't rat on my coach. But I'm pretty sure some of you wankers are going to carry on rattling my cage because you are so fucking stupid. You brainwashed, brain dead fucking pricks are really starting to piss me off. All right? Wake the fuck up and get real. Otherwise, you're going to die. And there's no choice in the matter. If you don't fucking wake up in the next week, you're going to have to die. And I don't really care how many people I wipe out at this moment in time. Because I've had enough of you fucking bunch of morons. I know, this ain't the right way to put it, but fuck. I really have enough of you brain dead motherfucking brainwashed pricks. Wake the fuck up. Oh, for fuck's sake, please wake up. This is your last warning, otherwise you'll die. Because I don't really care how many people die at this moment in time. If I have to wipe out half the planet, I have to wipe out half the planet. I don't want to do that. I, I would like to keep it to 5%, but if 95% of you have to go, you have to go. But that ain't going to happen. I'm not going to let 95% of you die out. I'm not that much of a gun. But um, it's still optional for 50-50. So, do you... 50% of you really want to die? I don't think you do. I don't want to kill you. I don't want to kill anybody, to be honest. I don't like killing anything. I get pissed off when I kill a fucking cockroach. And I killed a lot of them. I get pissed off when I kill a rat. And I fucking killed a lot of them. I've not killed humans yet. I don't want to kill humans. I like humans. Blue and up. I do actually like talking to you as well. I, I went out and um, had a chat with a few people on the phone. I know, they do look at me like I'm on a different planet now. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> I, I swear to you, I am on a different planet. Well, I am when it comes to intelligence. And I am when it comes to actually knowing what the fuck is going on in the world. And I'm really pissed off with the way you fucking assholes are playing. You're not playing fair, you're not playing nice. You're just being horrible, evil, soulless cunts. And you're going to have to have a slap one way or the other. Mm. Yeah. I think the only way to properly slap you little fucking assholes is... Kill half of you. Hopefully that might wake you up. If not, I'll have to kill all of you and start from scratch. And trust me, I don't want to do that. We have done it about five or six times already, so it won't matter if we do it another time, trust me. I can wipe a lot of you wankers off the planet, destroy the planet, and start again. I really, really don't want to do that because that's not me, that's not my nature. Actually, believe it or not, I'm, I'm a pacifist, softy, big eyed, 
still be counting. He just wants to make love with women and try my babies. <laughs> and a normal man thinks it. But, yeah, I can't seem to do that anymore. <clears throat> so, it's up to you lot. But you ain't got long to fucking choose. I did put the deadline down for this week, but I'll expand it another couple of weeks and see if you wankers can get your act together. I have the fuck you do, because I really don't want to work you out. I know, this is serious. I'm not joking, either. Do I look like I'm joking? Yeah, well, if I wipe you out, I'll go wipe myself out. I actually fancy having a good life. Believe it or not. I fancy having a bit of fun, going off and exploring the world and having a look at what the fuck is going on. Yeah. All right. I'm probably wishing way above my wish list, but what's the other option? We all die. Well, if you listen to the government and you take any notice of the government, you will die. If you take their crap and you listen to them fucking wankers, you're doomed. I'm trying to offer you a little branch of hope here, you know, a little tweak of hopeless. Grab all of this tweak. I know it's invisible, but grab all of it. I, I would recommend grabbing all of it. Let's go for it. Let's go for life instead of death, shall we? I did spend a lot of time in my youth trying to destroy myself. So I am a normal idiot on this planet and I have not exactly had a great life. <coughs> I spent way too much time being a slave to the system. And obviously, um, because of my skills, I got all sorts of weird, crappy jobs. <coughs> yes, I work for every sort of fucking organisation you can think of. And crap, the only thing I learned was I don't want to be a slave. You want to carry on being a slave? Well, actually, you won't have much of a choice at the moment. If you want to carry on being a slave, you're going to die very quickly because I don't need slaves. Slaves. I don't need slaves. I need fucking staff to help me out, not fucking slaves. Are you listening? No, I, I'm glad, actually, I'm glad you wankers ain't listening. I'm not actually going to post this video because it's way too heavy for your fucking assholes to fucking comprehend. No, I'm going to leave this one on the back burner. But if you wankers don't get your head together in the next couple of days, I will be posting it. And you know, when I post this shit, you've got two days to make your mind up. I'm not ready to post this shit. But do you want to live or do you want to die? I know most of you want to die. I want to die myself. 
I want you fucking evil bastards to come and shoot me in the head right now and put me out of my fucking misery. But you little cunts ain't gonna do that, are you? You're gonna make me suffer right up to the end with the rest of you little shit pricks. But you're all the same. We're all the fucking same at the end of the day. We're all shitty little humans in a shitty little human world full of fucking assholes trying to kill us. We're all getting bullied and robbed and raped day in, day out. Fucking shit, isn't it? What are we going to do about it anyway? I hope somebody comes up with an idea before I have to post this video because this ain't giving anybody any ideas. This is a bit doom and gloom. Fuck you. I really don't care anymore. I want to teach the kids something sensible. Like right, back in the day when I was young and stupid. At least when I when I had interact with interact with my children. I would teach them to play together nicely. What were you teaching them? Teachers, what are you teaching them now? Teaching them a bit gay. Chop their dicks off. Take their tits off. What the fuck is the matter with you little teacher cunts? Your fucking evil soulless cunts, as far as I'm concerned. Your brainwashed pricks. But that's just my opinion. You're lucky I'm not going to post this video yet. But trust me, if you piss me off much longer, I will post it off to the fucking whole world. You fucking gay fucked up, freaky, fucking paedophile pieces of shit can go and fucking kill yourselves. Now! Go on, fuck off. You brainwashed, brain-dead fucking pieces of shit. Yeah, I'm going to stop. Now, because... Fuck you, LGBTQ fucking P. And what does the P stand for? Pedophile, pedo fucking philic, fucking parasite, politician, pieces of shit. Fuck you.